Hello and welcome. This is Sahara playing Legends of Isenwald. And uh, we're back and we need to go take out the east side of uh, where the bitchins are at. And I went to click on this uh, smithy. I didn't think much would happen. <laughs> and then this message popped up. So, the apprentice opens the door of the smithy for you. The smith is working the sound of his hammer echoing even through the small room for you. Huh. Even through the small room you are led to, another man is sitting on a crudely fashioned bench. His face is hidden under the hood of his cloak. The apprentice hastily leaves, and you remain face to face with the stranger. So I'm wondering if this is Peter. Hmm? After a few moments, he pushes his hood back. Oh, it's Berthold! Hello, Corinne. Good to see you. Well, how you doing? At least you're still alive out of all the com the combat. I don't understand. Why are you here? Well, it's a long story. So, so perhaps, so perhaps you'd better sit down. No, I never would have known he was there if I hadn't walked in that smithy, and I could have busy. I could very well easily have gone by it, but you know me, I won't. Do you remember Castle Windy? Long ago, it belonged to Nicholas, a neighbor and friend to your father. His young wife died after bearing his son, and all the lights of his world went out and went dim. I'm sorry. He realized that he would never be happy again, so he decided to sacrifice himself for the happiness of his friend, Leonard. He willingly took upon himself the accusation for the burned cathedral and the fate of his and the fate of his child. Okay, is this gonna be a huge revelation here, right? Yeah, so this guy took, he sacrificed himself for his friend Leonard, who is my father. He only took upon himself the accusation for the burned cathedral and the fate of his child. Before he was exiled, he entrusted his child to the Craig family. You see, I am his son. Wow, raised by the Craigs, but not of their lineage. Okay, Berthold, I bet that had been kind of shocking to you to find out that you, um, okay. So you're the one that, okay. But Nicholas's story didn't end there. Leonard realized that his friend had sacrificed his life and honor for him, so he gave him, gave him something that would ease his own guilt. My father wasn't a very nice person, was he? Nicholas was stripped of his knighthood and banished, but no one could take away his military training and courage. He went far away to the north, to Pomeria and Samogeta, and he even fought at Tannenberg. And finally, he earned lands in a castle on the bank of the Elbe River, but he did not use his real name. Instead, he adopted the name Kloss. And later... Clausen von Sedlitz. Oh, that's your father? Remember how in Goldstein he wanted to talk to me in private? That's when I heard this story. So you've known all this time and never told me you were the son of... of... of Sedlitz. And Sedlitz was the guy who helped my father. Wow, okay. <clears throat> Wing is my true family name, and if your father was to be disposed according to the law, Lansdine would be handed to Nicholas's firstborn into my hands. Lansdine would be handed to Nicholas's firstborn into my hands. So Lansdine actually technically belonged to you anyway. Okay. After this, I looked at you differently. No, not jealousy, nothing like that. It was simply that I knew life to be unjust, and you became the symbol of everything unjust. I wanted to make things right, to finally have justice. I totally get where you're coming from. Left me in the middle. So why did you change your mind? Because I made a mistake. I thought perhaps that if you were gone, then justice would be gone too. But I realized later that my justice was a lie, an unnecessary ritual like beautiful clothing upon a weak body. There are rules about justice that are dedicated to are are dictated to us, but there is something else inside us that tells us to act according to our own natures. The innate truth, conscience, and it is a hundred times more valuable than any law, for the body is more valuable than any clothing. According to the law, I had to own your land, but, go, but according to my conscience, you are yet my friend. 
Well, thank you, Berthold, but I lost most of my soul along the way. You do not realize what I've lost. The one who sacrifices conscience for justice receives not justice, but its illusion. Alas, I understood that too late. Uh, I think I sacrificed my conscience already for justice. Silence fills the room. It seems the smith has ceased his work, or perhaps you just can't hear it. Berthold's words are heavier than any hammer. Yes, yes they are. Why didn't you tell me all this in Trevor? Yes, because it would have changed some of my decisions. It would seem like an excuse. I would have told you that you didn't own Landstein anymore and then added that you never had a right to own it. But I didn't want to lessen my guilt. Now it doesn't matter anymore. But it does because of some of my actions. And what do you intend to do? Same as before. If you will have me, I will go with you. This time to the very end. Okay, Berthold. Like a yo-yo back and forth. Or some of our politicians. Okay. So he is now with me. Oh. Suddenly I got all these people with me? Oh. What? How did I end up with all these? Oh, that's right. I forgot. <laughs> I forgot which, which map I was on. I was doing my, um, yeah. Never mind. Never you mind. I got it now. I got it now. So, that's right, he can be on a, uh, which one is the best for him, he needs a saddle, he needs a lance, okay, um, a halberd is pretty nice, but it's two-handed weapon. So now I got two people. I can get rid of him then, I suppose. But I'm afraid that he might not last long. Hmm, interesting. Yeah, I forgot I was I thought I was on the last um <laughs> on the last map. Why would are they saying this is better? Four and two. Cause this doesn't have yeah, this is four and two, and this is, no, I don't think so. I just don't think he caught up with himself. Okay, so, do I want to give him this or not? Hmm. Stunning blow. Melee attack. This has four melee attack, and this has 12 melee attack. Intent initiative. And this is 30% initiative. Or I'm sorry, is it minus? No, it's 50% initiative. I think I might I might go ahead and buy it just for shits and grins, but this just keeps okay. And um so anything here I can buy for any of my other peoples. And then I have to reshuffle. Ooh, better bow. Yes. But he's got one over here too. Let me see. Um, this is just a bow bow, a composite bow. This is a recurve bow. This is ranged, two ranged, but this has initiative. Is initiative really that that big of a thing? Hmm. I mean, really, is it? Is it truly? Hmm. Let's see. Now it says it's not. Okay, because I clicked off of it. All right. So, um. Interesting, interesting. So I do have, so we got three people mounted. We want to put him there, we're gonna put him there. Um, we don't need all, I can just probably get rid of you then, right? Or put you there in the back, put him up front. Anybody use, oops, wait a minute, wait a minute. He can use this now. So I'm gonna have three people on horseback. That is gonna be amazing. You have the slot open, you should do. Let's give you that. Okay. 
interesting indeed. So all the stories that are coming out, finding Ludwig. So I think I'm going to go, it seems like it'd be easier to fight up to the north, but there's no, there's no cathedrals up here. Hmm. To heal from, well, but I, maybe I'll be able to get to heal from the castle. All right, let's go over here. Let's go here into the... Not like we need to confuse ourselves more with stuff, but really I'm looking for is what... Oh, they don't have any of that here. Oops, he can use that. Okay. They don't have any weapons, okay. Any better horse for you? Any better horse for you? Sword stuff? No. Cool. I. All right. High medals. I know if I take this, we're going to end up um losing it again, but that's fine. Ooh, and I can heal here. That is good to know. I can heal here now. All right. Good. So, we're going to go this way. Oop, there was somebody in here. Alright, we're going to take you out. Well, yeah, I'll take you out. There he is, on horse, when he's not on horse. <laughs> so, okay. Why are you picking on my noble? Now he's dead. Hmm. I wish you had run through, but you don't. Okay. And you're stuck back there, so wait. This one out almost. That's a halberd. Come on. Okay. You come up here. And get rid of this one. could come up and do his little damage. All right, that'll work. You can come up. Let's just take her out. Let's see who all needs healed. All right, get up here. I'm standing in your face. Okay, you're done. Put invigorate on you. Come up here, take out this one. They should surrender, but they're not. All right, come over here, take this one out. No, they should. Done. Nope. No, you're done. Bye. You want leveled up? Nope. God, what is this? Uh, poisoned weapon. Ooh, those are always nice. Poisoned weapon. Who can use that? He's got that halberd. I don't know whether I should give that to him or not. Anybody use a poisoned weapon? Nope. 
Would have been nice. Okay. So we got one dead already, so let's go over here. All right, I know we're going to have a fight. Nope, guess we're not. Just come in here and heal. Who's this? Let's take these guards out, because you're going to take on my... Yep, I knew that was going to happen. That's fine. Um, bigger eight. Him. I should have invigorated him. He's the one that really needs it. Okay, I should take him out. Nope, it won't, but that's okay. He's not on a horse. Wow. Okay, you're stuck. That's 28, 22. Just take him out. Him. Good thing I healed him up. her out. Let's do Bridget's heal. Okay. Not everyone died. Go heal up again. Alrighty. And can he my bowman use those? Yes, he can. Cool. All right. Oh, I wonder why it's a deserted village. Another battle. Ooh, okay. These should be fairly easy. They're all apostles, it looks like. Yep. This is Jerus. Yeah, you should be able to not run them, but you're just not quite that strong yet. How come? Oh, because I forgot to put him on his horse, didn't I? How stupid. Let's go ahead and invigorate him. He needs it. Now, you have run through, so you should be able to just take him down. Let's get to the back back here. Here we go. You can get up here, knock him over. Almost. And we'll just take him out then. Invigorate him. Up here. Get you back in the back. Leave Berthold alone! Leave my noble alone! Get you out of here. And they surrendered. Okay. Cool. Slowly taking them. I know they're going to disappear. I know that. I know that. All right. Um, but we're making our way up to the north. Can we even get over here anymore? I don't think we can. Yep, see, that's even all blocked off now. That castle that was over there. All right. Fisherman's Wharf. 
kites. We'll take that. Not that we can... Ooh, here's the healer woman. Don't want to get rid of him and get a healer woman? Hmm. I think I might do that. But is he better? Okay, let me see. Is he better? Yeah, but... Alright, he is... Get rid of him. We're gonna hire you. Because we always need healers. All right. That will work. Hmm. Okay. I don't want them together. to the in here on its own. They just someone just took my fisherman's wharf, of course. No. Stuff to talk about. Yep. Mm -hmm. Alright. <laughs> I just go back and forth until I kill everybody. Alright, let's go ahead and get you out. Okay. There we go. Come on. Oh, and I forgot to, damn it, I forgot to mount him again. Neither one of them are mounted. Why is that? Okay. Bit of you. Okay. Yeah, you come up here after this one. Maybe I think I'll wait a turn on her. You come up here. I should take you up. Oh, it almost should have. All right. Let's invigorate him. Gotta take him down. 27. Yes, it will. Come up over here on this bowman. You come up here on this one. Take him out. Cool. Oh, really? All right. You couldn't last. Just another round. bit tough. He is a little bit tough, so I'm going to go ahead and heal you up over here. And then again, take you out. and heal you. And let's get you out of nope, didn't take you out. I'm shocked. Alright, that will. You'll be done now. I mean you're not giving up, really. Okay. Ah, you're gone. Bye. He ended up dead again. Oh, my 
Archer. Yes, he leveled up. Oh wait, so we have a crossbowman or not? Okay, he's a crossbowman. He's gonna go as, as an archer. Yes, okay. Cool. Um, poor guy, you just keep dying, don't you? We don't want it. Okay. Do you got piercing blow? You'd think piercing blow would be better. Hmm, we'll see. We'll see. You don't think we can get over to there? No, we can't. This is all areas we can't get to. Okay. Oh, I, I was already in here. There's nothing here. Okay, so the next one is, before I even do that, let us get these people mounted. <clears throat> Why is he not mounted? He should be mounted, yes. Now he's mounted. Okay, oh. Okay. It, it makes no sense. I don't get it. Uh, this is the problem that it's having. Okay, so if I do this, it's got piercing blow. Come on. Come on. Ugh. Okay, so if I give him that and then mount him, that should maybe make a difference. I hope. Okay. Time to save. One more battle. What do we have in here? Oh, don't run away. Where are you going? All right, now I got three on horseback. Yay! Okay. This looks so much better. And you're a necromancer, aren't you? Yes, you are. We can get rid of you right away. We don't need any spooks. No spooks. Okay. No, he's the only one that really needs it. Um, instead, let's go ahead and invigorate him. Oh, really? Okay. You have run through, so you should be able to run him over. Nope, you can't. Alright, now I have to heal her. She's my best one, so she's got to get healed. Go ahead and get him down. Go ahead and take him out. Maybe. <sighs> Guess not. Alright, which one? This way? I think we go this way. Come up here. Well, on this one, you're going to get poked. Okay, you can heal. He needs it. Up here. You're done. I know we got archers, but if I take out these people in front. Yep, there we go. Need my leveled up. Nope. Cool. Oh, there's so many in them. Oh, one person. Okay. Well, I probably should take you down. <laughs> okay. That was easy. Easy peasy. Easy peasy. What, you can garrison here in the lighthouse? That seems odd. Can't get up into here. None of this is... Okay, so last thing left is this castle.
We got a necromancer in there. I'm pretty sure that's what that is. All right, here we go. Yes, begin assault. That, oh. Yeah. I just realized now it's 30 minutes. We'll complete this fight, take out this castle, and then we will um, end this episode. All right. Okay. Yeah, there she goes. Okay, who's next? He is next. Take you out, then it opens up to the archers. Such a weak guy. Too weak, and you're stuck in there, so we'll wait. Yeah, he's going to go down now, isn't he? All right, heal you up then. I think he's in a bad position. Okay. Um... That's gone. Can't do anything. We go after this one. Well, thank you for going after him instead of my noble, because. Okay, let's take you out. And they surrendered. She died. She's got three ticks. How could she three have three ticks? We just got her and we got a silver weapon here. Yes. Okay. Cool. One more castle down. Um. Anybody use that silver weapon? He can't. He can't either. We got a silver weapon nobody can use. But you got a better crossbow. And this. That'll work. That will work indeed. And what's this? Um, spiritual power. So we want something like this up there. Huh. There we go. Okay. So everything is taken. Everything, well, except for this. Come on. But I can take you back. Now you're mine. It's all green on this side. I think I've got everybody. Right? I always wondered what those were for. Even in the last the last time we were here. Okay, come in here to level up. Nobody in there I have to fight. No. There will be. Jorgen the Horseshoe. Aha, look our quarry lies before us. Don't try to run from Jorgen the Horseshoe. My riders and I will hunt you down. Really? Okay. <coughs> I should have saved, which I was thinking of doing. But we got a necromancer back there or not? No, she's just a witch. She'll do some damage, but... Okay. Okay, they're going to do some damage to us. I do see that. Yep, you're gone. You were already going to be gone anyway. Let's... If a, if a fight isn't... If a fight isn't, um... Hard, then it's really not fun, you know? We take this one down, 20. No, close. We need to take these archers down. Okay, come on, Bert Holt. 
Oh, you just did something to my... And you're stuck back there, aren't you? Yes, you are. Okay, let's heal. We better get her healed, otherwise... Okay, let's get this one gone. Okay. You're done. You're done. All right, let's see here. Take this one down. Yep, that one's gone. I can't do any damage to these. Do more damage to her. Let's go get her. You gonna go over here. And you still can't get out. Damn it. Alright, let's see. Who needs healed? He needs healed big time. Get her gone. She's gone. All right. And over here. Okay. We just might have this. And the monk gets to come out and do a little damage. Okay. I was really had my doubts about this. Okay, he's now on. We got several of them that are injured, so let's just go ahead and. You're gonna come over here and finish him off. Love the horseback. I forgot she had dismount. No, that was the other one. So I lost two. I lost my healer woman again. Uh. Hmm, I'm gonna lose him next time. Please, have mercy. Really, you idiot. Why should I spare you? But perhaps I will let you live if you tell me where you acquired these horses by their breeding. They are worth quite a lot. I'll, excuse me. I'll tell you everything. There is a horse breeder called Jost who resides in Winfield. News of the Duke's son's rebellion reached the Chancellor, and he ordered every man who has showed any sign of collusion to be brought in. Jost left Winfield soon after and we found his new location, a house near Wetwood. Ah, we took the horses from him. I see. Now if I ever see you on a horse again, I will finish what I started here. Get out of my presence. Wait, this rogue said that Jost fled the city and went to live by a house near Wetwood. And we know that someone, Jacob's partner, is courting the horse breeder's daughter. It is no great assumption then that this someone is none other than Arnott, Arnott, Arnold the Pilgrim. Right, Joss's daughter should know where to find Arnold. We need to visit that house. Okay. I need to get healed. And we're gonna get healed. Okay. Anything we need to buy here? Nope, there's nothing we can buy. You can use this. Hmm. All right, so we know where this is at. Let's go back away. Wetwood is over here. Because I mentioned that, um, that I said that that house was over there and there's never been a house over there before. Oh, apostles, let's just go ahead and get rid of them. Because they will be easy to get rid of. Oh, I keep forgetting what time it is. Darn it. See, I just get involved in the game and forget about the recording. Ha! So easy to do. All right, you're done. Invigorate you, since you seem to always need it. Run through. It's not going to last long anyway. Kill this one, and then this one, and they're going to be done, pretty much. Come on. Yep. All right. So I need to. All right. So I am going to close down this episode. If you enjoyed it, click like, leave a comment, subscribe, and um, thank you for watching. Sahara out.